Hello, darlings, <laughs> and welcome back to our channel. I'm Jason. And I'm Chris. And because the new Cruella movie just came out, we just watched it today, yep. streaming now on Disney Plus. Um, it is amazing. It was absolutely amazing. So fashion. You definitely forward. need to watch it if you haven't seen it. We loved really it good. so much yeah. that we have decided to share with you guys our collection of the 101 and Dalmatians and Cruella bags. <laughs> yeah, we got a little inspired today after watching the movie, and um, we do have a few bags by Loungefly that are all related to either Cruella or 101 Dalmatians. Um, the first bag we're going to show you is the first one we actually got. Um, when we started collecting last summer, this was one of the first ones we ever ordered because we were obsessed with all the character bags, and this one was one of the ones that was available. Especially the villains. Those yeah, were our first Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, and we actually lucked out because we ordered off Amazon, and it was like a month and a half, and finally Amazon was like, we're sorry, we're just going to send you another one. We don't know what happened to it. They both arrived on the same day. So we have two of this Cruella bag. <laughs> so exciting. One to keep and one to one play to with. Carry. We took this one to Disney actually, so it's gotten a lot of use. And then we still have our new with tags um, hidden away. So. And I've been carrying her all week for the premiere. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, obviously you can see it's like that villain character bag. Um, it's got that raise up front, which is really cool. You know, it gives it so much more detail. Um, and you do have, you know, the Loungefly logo right here in the front. Um, no charm on this bag, though. No charm. But we created one. Yes, we had to have our <laughs> own. As you can see, this is from, actually, the Dollar Tree. So I made this myself to put a little charm yep. on here. So I feel like, um, I guess his name is Patch. I feel like he was definitely needed to be on this bag because it's full of spots. Yep. I love the red detailing in this bag. It's I know. Really it's really pretty. Um, if you turn around the back, you do have the black straps with the red. Um, and then, you know, all on the sides and everything, there's that red detail. You got side the side pockets, pockets <laughs> which are awesome. A must. Um, if you open it up, though, a little bit lacking on the inside, just red. You know, there's no back pocket, no zipper pocket, nothing like that. Um, but you know what? The character face bag, it, I mean, these are everything, so... Um, I can't remember on the front. I think it's just black and white if you unzip the... Yeah, yeah half it's just, half. just black and white on there, too. So, at least you get a little bit of detail down in here, you know? It's not just, like, red, like, the inside, so... But, um, yeah, of course, we love this bag. It's lounge fly. Why would you not? So this is one of two Corella bags we have. So I would say this is Corella's, like, fashion face. Like, yeah. this is what she looks like all the time. She does have a skin tone here. Um, gold, metal, gold metal hardware on the sides, as you can see. New with tags, as always. And the backs are red and black. Mm -hmm. Just a great, great Cruella bag. Yeah, yeah. Um, but we do have another Cruella bag. Um, I think we're going to pop it into a second video, just so we don't have to take up all your time. Um, so definitely get ready for that. Um, we're going to make it right now. Thanks, guys. Bye. 